Right, in my hands I have the Corda Basics unhooking mat, and inside this unhooking mat, I also have the Corda Basics way sling, and it is nicely concealed inside, designed purposely to do so. So the combo of the two can be carried, transported, and used together neatly, nicely, and easily. Now, first thing to do is open this mat up because as I'm sure you've probably worked out, it's not in this shape that you use it. So if I grab hold of one of these zips, we'll ping it open and have a little look inside. Grab the zip. Put it onto the floor. And now this half moon shape will turn into an oval, perfect for housing a carp. Here's the waist thing, we'll look at that in a second. For now, we'll just concentrate on the mat. Now, in the base here, there is a 50 mil piece of foam, which ensures you've got plenty of padding to protect the fish, very important. And then on the sides here, you've got more padding in what makes this a cradle style unhooking mat. The idea being that rather than just having the flat piece of padding on the bottom to protect the fish from beneath, you've got the sides to hold the carp safely within the mat if it flaps around that kind of thing. And this being one of the basics products within Corda's range, this is for the beginner. So it's not a ginormous mat. You know, if you're catching 40, 50 pounders, I would say personally, this isn't the mat for you. But if you're getting into fishing, you know, you're catching doubles, 20s, maybe carp up to say 30 pounds, then a mat like this is perfect. So you've got the padding in the base, you've got the padding and the extended sides. And the material this mat is made from has a fish friendly coating to ensure that it doesn't remove the slime from the carp, which every mat should have. And because I'm kneeling in a rather uncomfortable field, I'm gonna use this mat to protect my knees whilst we look at the way sling. As you can see, it comes in a nice little carry bag with a toggle at the top. If I open that, open it up, or you can pop the sling out. Right, first thing to notice, it is folded in half. And here, you've got male and female parts that as I open this up, will interlock, forming two solid bars. And there you go, there's your way sling. So in there, you will get carp, once again, I'd say up to sort of 30 pounds, maybe a little bit bigger. But being a basics way sling, you know, this is once again for guys that are entering the sport, don't want to spend loads of money, but want a product that does a job well, and this will do that. If I open the sling up, you will see here, You've got large drainage holes, which just helps the water always wet your sling before you put a carp in it. So once you've wet it, these holes will help the water drain out. You don't want to be adding water weight to a carp, and you also don't want to be drying them out. So make sure you wet it and use these holes to drain any excess water out of the sling before you weigh the fish. If I pick the sling back up, you will see at either end there is a zip. And once again, important to do these up when using the sling make sure the fish stays safely inside. One at one end and one at the other. And with those done up, your carp will be safely held within the wasteling. You've got the handle here at the top to carry a fish with should you need to, and of course to attach your scales to when weighing it. And that's about it really. So there we go. Basics wasteling, basics unhooking mat, a lovely little combination which is perfect for those of you that might be getting into the sport.